Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Anka and I do art and illustration related videos and sometimes tattoo related videos. So if you're into that, make sure you subscribe and check out the other videos on my channel. So today's video is a pretty exciting one. I actually had the chance to do my first tattoo on real skin over this past weekend. In this video, you will see me practice some monstera leaves. I was getting ready to do the, the actual tattoo on the client during this practice and I thought I would share some things that nobody told me about doing my first apprentice tattoo and maybe that will be helpful for you if you are starting off with tattooing basically i have been going to a tattoo shop for a couple of months now the woman who owns the tattoo shop is a very nice a person she lets me stay by her side while she's working and gives me all sorts of tips and she actually told me to find some volunteers and start tattooing on real skin because that's the only way you can actually learn so i asked a couple of friends if they would be willing to be my first uh, tattoo canvas and one of my friends accepted to come over the weekend and get tattoos so he wanted a monstera leaf we went with a simple design and when I got to the shop, I started setting up my station. I wrapped up everything so that it's sterile. I pr prepared my machine, my inks, my Vaseline and everything you need. The whole process of setting up the station was pretty easy since I've been doing it at home as well. And yeah, once the client got to the tattoo shop, I cleaned the skin. I I used the razor to remove any excess hair that he had on his arm and applied the stencil. The stencil application was pretty easy, uh, the tattoo shop has a stencil printer which makes things super easy, uh, it's nothing compared to doing stencils by hand, everything is much more crisp and you can see the details much better. And so we applied the stencil and then we got started on the tattoo. Now one thing that helped me a lot was my mentor telling me everything I needed to know before starting. So basically she helped me out with my machine settings, she helped me out with uh, the overall station setup and she just told me to be patient, don't hurry and take my time. That's what I tried to do. The whole tattoo took about three hours, which was a bit long for the client, but uh, I really didn't want to rush through it. So one of the things that um, I encountered and didn't think about and I think nobody tells you about uh, when doing your first tattoo is the fact that skin has texture so that's one of the main things that threw me off fake skin is very smooth it's nice to lay down on a flat surface and you don't have much trouble with line work once you get it down but working on textured skin is quite difficult and keeping the needle depth consistent was one of the things I found the hardest. Some lines are a bit wonky, um, I try to keep my hand as steady as possible, but it was quite difficult for my first tattoo. We did go with a big design and quite a complicated design, but I still think we chose the right design because uh, when doing your first tattoo I wouldn't recommend you do any geometric stuff, no straight lines, no perfect circles, you will definitely fuck those up. So. I would recommend you go with a very organic design, something simple like a leaf should work just fine. This design is very forgiving with mistakes, you can easily pass them off as being part of the leaf. Of course, some lines are not perfect, but we can always go over them again or add to the tattoo since it's so open and there is a lot of negative space. Another thing that I think I did wrong was not stretching the skin enough, so that might have been one of the reasons some of my lines were shaky. Uh, stretching the skin on fake skin is not something you can actually do very much, so I would recommend you practice that three point stretch that I was talking about a couple of videos ago. Overall, the whole tattoo experience was really exciting. I haven't felt this excited for something in a long time. My friend was pretty happy with it. He said if once it heals, it needs touch-ups, he will come for them and we will see after it heals how it looks. I will definitely include some pictures of it healed once time has passed, but yeah, I'm pretty proud of myself that I got over this first step in my tattoo journey. And from now on, it's all about practice, practice and making perfect lines and finding volunteers to practice on. But yeah, I'm, I'm actually pretty proud of this. I had a lot of nerves going into it but i overcame those nerves and that fear and i was kind of in the zone once i was doing the tattoo and i think i i could get really good at this uh i just need 
the practice. So overall, my tips for making your first tattoo is to go with a simple organic design. Keep in mind that skin has texture. Don't rush it and stretch the skin <laughs> and practice as much as you can before on fake skin. So these would be my top advices when going into your first tattoo and yeah i hope you found this video helpful and let me know in the comments if you have any advice for somebody's first uh, apprentice tattoo it would be helpful for anybody looking to get into tattoos so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye